Now, unfortunately, Pantani was 1.72 meters tall. Therefore, his bike would be microscopic. However, fortunately, one of his loyal climbing domestiques, Riccardo Falcone, was almost exactly my size, but this very machine was used in both the Giro and the Tour that year to support Marco on his way to victory. Now, this unfortunately didn't go quite as fast as Pantani's, but if you're worried that it lacks a little bit of that rock and roll swagger, then don't be. Falcone was actually thrown out of the Giro in 98 on the final stage because he had too many red blood cells and he also then went positive for EPO just as soon as a test was invented three years later. Those are the days, eh?